we have limited time. I okay. think that the, 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 the time that you bought on space that you bought will be, you know, um, uh, gone what? Will, oh. be, will be gone soon. And so we need to ensure that your money I, gets yes. the value, you know, in, in, the, in the shortest period the shortest of time that the, the, sure. the company has given us. Um, you claim that uh, you want to alleviate poverty in this country. Yes. All right? Um, one would wonder, and one would ask this very important question, that look, from the time the Patriotic Front came into power, the number of things that they've done, they have built schools, right? They have uh, opened up this country in terms of ensuring that they built communication towers, they've built roads. Uh, the, the Patriotic Front boasts of improving, you know, the infrastructure development of this country. They've built hospitals, they've increased meal allowances, you know, for, for loan schemes rather, uh, you know, for, for, for those uh, that, that are students. And someone would say, I think we are okay with the patriotic front. Oh, ask me. I say, that's why some they say I support Rongo, even though I don't. Uh, I support him when he, where he's right, and where he's wrong, I do not support him. Here's the question of the, the fly over bridge. I, I laughed when I heard that it would congest the <laughs> Zambian vehicles. <laughs> I just laughed. The reason why I loved it is that, you know, that flyover bridge, you can go with your car there, but when you go, you go the side, you meet another, another uh, flat road again, you meet other, you join another, then how do it is congest? <laughs> my dear friend, you know, it is a question of In my government, let me tell you the difference. When I've been set so up... So there's everything wrong with the flyover bridges? The, everything is, wrong with that, it just only creates a problem. When you fly there, you join the other group there. And then there are other vehicles this side, there are other vehicles that side. What will happen? Then you, you even create more problems there. So now, when I've been set out, what I'm going to do? We shall put up stair roads. The other vehicles are move, moving down. All cities, Rusaka city, starting from Rusaka, Kitwe, all this, we shall connect all the provincial centers with the up stair roads. The other roads down. The other road on top. The main buses, because in my government, I'll create a revenue. But those who are working, the minimum wage will be 10 million. So they will be able to have cars. There will be a lot of cars like what you see here. In my government, a lot of cars will be here in Zambia. People will buy cars. They will have money. All those who are not working in my government will be getting 2 million salary. If they are 10, it will be 10 times 2. They have 20 million. So even those families, if they want to put together their resources, they can buy a car. So there will be a lot of cars in this country. Therefore, my plan on strategy, which I've already put, there will be roads, down road and up, up roads, where you only, there's bigger cars like buses and the, and the roads, there will be on the flat road, the down road, ground road. Then these two small cars will be on top there. What we do, we build the whole street of Rusaka. Hmm? to the nearest uh, suburb or the uh, district, countrywide, that's in my, job, my job. Then once we have done that, then the vehicles will now be moving. You just press a button, you go to the level of movement. This is the development project which I'll do. And of course, I'll print money to facilitate all that job. I'll create more jobs, more than 12 million, for road construction, bridge everywhere. Each road, we shall put down road, we shall put fish bond. The drainages will be fish bond. So that we have got fish to the people to eat. My government, there's nothing you are going to throw. My first diploma in stores management, IPS, I was trained that there's scraps and the byproducts. You, you eat something, then you throw it. That what you throw can be taken to the industry and they produce something. For example, when you throw a bottle after drinking, uh, Fanta there. If you, that bottle is taken to the bottler, they will make, they will, they will use that bottle, they will give you money in exchange. If you throw mm. a plastic... So, but, but let's talk about, you know... The, so, the, although, I want you, you know, to bring back the, the, yeah, of course, of course. my government. Uh, yeah. Then from there, I'll have my crops again. and the animal husbandry in each and every district. Of course. We shall have bumper harvest. Uh, President Muliokela, I, yes. I, I asked you about what is wrong 
the patriotic front government has embarked on a robust infrastructure this is what agenda. i'm explaining thank you so much i'm coming they've built hospitals yes i'm coming they've to built that. schools they've invested heavily in, in, in education exactly i'm we're, coming what the problem of load shedding but load shedding at your place is, is, is an issue of the past please, please give me chance let me come Explain. in let me come in you know we are talking i'm talking about over fly over bridge that is my first topic out of what you say mm. I said why, and what is my plan over that? Of course. Why I think that is a waste of, sheer waste of money for those uh, fly over bridge. Mm. It's a sheer waste of money. To me, according to my understanding and knowledge. Okay. So I'll put it upstairs. Now let us come to schools and uh, hospitals. Of course. To me, those schools and the hospital, they are private institutions for the patriotic front. Because the beneficiary to those schools are themselves. What do and they're not the people of Zambia. What do you mean, President? The reason is this. Taxpayers' money, whatever you buy this VAT, value added tax, which you go to the revenue. At the same time, on behalf of my fellow poor people, every day you are receiving the minister receiving donation from well-wishers, donors, on behalf of the poor people. And that is the money they use to construct that, that school, to construct that clinic. But now, when you go to that clinic, the doctor says, go and buy medicine. Is he no longer a private? He likes even go to, he knows even the, the clinic where you can, the, the shop where you can buy that medicine. Because it is his own benefit. So the beneficiary are themselves. The Zambians have to pay for that fat institution. Your children have to pay school fees. Even the university students are languishing there. In my government, such things will not be there. In, according to Article Number 26 of the General Assembly, the, the law says that everybody, every, let's wait, everybody, everyone, what does everyone mean? Go to your dictionary. Everyone should live a decent life. That is Article Number 25. Everyone should go to school free, free of charge. Only, uh, you know, high schools like master degree holder. Starting from grade one up to bachelor of science degree, the schools are supposed to be free, free, free. Only someone who go a postgraduate degree like master degree, PhD, is when he can pay because he's already a graduate. That's what the law says. But now, go to the ground. Students are paying. Those poor people are failing to take their children to school. This, the government school have been turned into a private school for President Rungu and his cabinet ministers. There are the people who are enjoying the resources. It is like you if you build the infrastructure of this building. You are the one who is enjoying receiving the money. As for the poor people, they have nothing in common to assess there. That's why my government will be different from President Rungu in the sense that I will provide two million salary to every Zambian who is not working. At the same you time, two thousand two million. Two million. Well, that's really the so-called two thousand in Rungu will be two million because I will remove all the uh, tumako in which they, they printed. I will print proper denomination. So now we are going to make sure that the poor people are coming out of poverty. Education will be free. Grade one up to university. What I say, university means Bachelor of Science degree. Master of Science, someone is already a graduate. He can now pay for his master. He can now pay for his PhD. That is his problem. So as for grade one up to university will be free.